I direct the High Risk Prostate Cancer Clinic in the Department of Urology, which is a special clinic for men who have been identified as being a high risk for developing prostate cancer on the basis of either a strong family history of the disease or a specific genetic mutation. I work very closely with a team of genetic counselors in the Mass General Cancer Center. Um, at, where, we, where we offer genetic testing for patients who either have prostate cancer and have a strong or compelling family history, or those who don't have cancer, but uh, for instance, might be family members of, of patients who have been identified as having a genetic mutation um, or have a, a relevant family history. And when we identify men who uh, do have mutations that increase their risk for prostate cancer, we feel that these patients ought to be screened more aggressively or more intensely than the average patient in the general population, given that they have a higher risk of developing prostate cancer. So that's really what the High Risk Clinic is all about. It's a place where uh, we perform enhanced prostate cancer screening for men who are at higher risk, either due to their family history or to a specific identified genetic mutation. This is an area in, in prostate cancer care that uh, has been underappreciated, I, th I think, uh, and, and more recently, there's been greater attention in the, uh, onto the role of genetics and family history in the development of prostate cancer. And so we're seeing more of this happening around the country uh, very recently, but it's a fairly unique uh, clinic um, that yeah, we just started here at Mass General very recently. Um, and one additional unique aspect of it is that uh, we've opened a research study, a clinical study, where we're, we are trialing uh, enhanced screening protocols for men who are at high risk. And so what, whereas for the general population, we typically use PSA blood tests and prostate examinations to screen for prostate cancer, here we're incorporating additional uh, blood-based biomarkers as well as multi-parametric MRIs of the prostate as a form of enhanced screening for this patient population that's at higher risk. And we're essentially evaluating whether or not this screening protocol is effective for, for these high-risk patients. One of the special things about doing research at Mass General is the collaborative team that we have, uh, particularly in the genital urinary oncology group. Uh, we have an outstanding team of uh, urologists and radiation oncologists and medical oncologists, pathologists and radiologists all working together to focus all their attention on prostate cancer patients um, among other genital urinary uh, malignancies. And while we're, we, we're of course striving always to uh, deliver excellent clinical care, the other advantage of this group is that it forms a very powerful research team um, that uh, is very collaborative. The nice thing about uh, the Harvard Medical School and Mass General Cancer Center um, and all the neighboring institutions is that uh, we have very strong collaborations and uh, it allows us to really leverage everybody's expertise across the campuses to um, you know, think of compelling research ideas and, and execute them.